This clip is brought to you by VegasWinners.com. Get expert sports betting advice from some of the best handicappers in the world. Head on over to VegasWinners.com and win yourself some money. Hey, hey, it's Conrad Thompson, and you're listening to My World with the Hall of Famer, Jeff Jarrett. Jeff, how are you, man? Oh, Conrad, I am doing awesome today. Had some uh, rest and relaxation uh, recently, and college football's rocking and rolling, pro football's rocking and rolling. Lots of, uh, as I say, uh, lots of moving parts, but I'm excited to be sitting down here today. We're going to dive into a topic that, uh, candidly, Conrad, I have pretty good recall. And on this, because of, I guess you could say the end result, uh, a couple of things jarred my memory, but man, once I started going down a few different rabbit holes, we're going to be talking about Puerto Rico and basketball camps as a kid and mid South Coliseum talking to maybe a walk down memory lane there and Jimmy Hart, the mouth of the South. We got lots of different granular details coming up. I hope I don't uh, get chastised by you today. And I hope you're in a good mood. You've had some, uh, some ups and downs here recently, but, but one oh, up. Oh, oh, really? So you're all, we're going there. We're talking about Alabama finally losing a football game. Is that way we're starting today? I promise you, I wanted to talk about anything, uh, but them laying this big fat egg, but you tell me the last weekend that Tennessee won and Alabama lost. Well, well, let me ask you this <laughs> before the season started, we'll go back to this summer when you and I were hanging out, okay. you, were, you were stomping around Huntsville talking about the Titans were going to win the damn super bowl. Y'all lost to the fucking jets. And I didn't say a word. Stop. Trains can't. <laughs> <laughs> hey, let's, uh, l- let's take a minute here to talk about, you said you had some time for rest and relaxation. And I know that normally doesn't mean that you're going to sit down and consume more wrestling, but I also know that you're a wrestling junkie and, uh, those are your terms, not mine. If, <laughs> if, if you, um, if you identify like Jeff does as a wrestling junkie, I got to ask, what do you think Jeff of part one of conversations with Conrad with your dad, Jerry Jarrett? That's a loaded question, pal. That, that's really a loaded question because we've had this conversation about his book. Yes. And it, it, you know, it's, it's, it is obviously a, uh, I am in a very unique, um, very unique position here, but I'll say this, uh, I am very grateful to, uh, the entire ad free team. Obviously you're the leader of the team there, but, uh, it takes a, a lot of folks to have a lot of moving parts from editors and producers and camera and all that get done. So right out of the gate, I'm going to tell you, I'm very grateful because, uh, I encouraged a few folks, um, candidly, and I think I've shared this with you, uh, up North to say, Hey man, um, I, I'll say this, that, uh, my father, uh, is sort of, uh, I don't think he'll live another 50 years uh, candidly, but to sit him down, he's, um, you know, Conrad, he may be the last territory promoter. And so the stories, um, that he has, and just sort of the, the historical perspective and, you know, the Jerry Lawler story, uh, it is so unique, the Hulk Hogan, the territory. Uh, but you know, when he, uh, you know, sailor, uh, I, I, I heard you have a good little chuckle on how he got broke into the business, uh, getting trained and his, his mother, Christine Jarrett, who I always call teeny as a grandmother, but just hearing the history, um, told in that format, uh, I can tell you, it did my heart good. And, and, you know, it's preserved, uh, for generations to come. So I'm, I'm really am grateful, but, um, He's a storyteller. Uh, he's long winded. Uh, so, um, you know, don't chastise me. I get it honestly, uh, from getting granular. Would you say that's a fair assessment? <laughs> Man, I just wanted you to sell adfreeshows.com. You didn't say it not one time. Uh, just sit down with uh, part one of conversations with Conrad with legendary promoter, Jerry Jarrett. And as a reminder, He's more than just the old chicken salad routine. You've heard on another one of my podcasts. He's responsible for the, uh, 
you know, the early days of Hulk Hogan, the ultimate warrior sting stone cold, Steve Austin, the rock on and on and on. It's probably easier to make a list of folks he didn't work with. And uh, we get into the nitty gritty of not only his background and how he got into wrestling as a multi-generation wrestling business personality himself, but raising kids in the wrestling business, starting his own promotion in the wrestling business, being a victim of politics and sort of the old Memphis screw job, lots of stuff that maybe you've never heard before about the NWA and some hypotheticals about dusty roads. It's all available now in part one of conversations with Conrad and uh, part two is coming later this month over at adfreeshows.com. All right, let's run a timeout right now and give you a heads up. Attention sports betters. Has anyone ever given you a thousand dollars before? Well, Jeff, our guest at this time is trying to do just that. Welcome to the program. The king of Vegas sports gambling and America's odds maker. It's Wayne Allen root. Wayne, how are you? Hey, Conrad. Hey, Jeff. I'm not trying to give you a thousand dollars free. I'm giving you a thousand dollars free at VegasWinners.com. That's my website. And I know so many people in the wrestling world love to bet on football. It's an American pastime. It's now legal in most states, a majority of American states. And guys love to bet on football. But I know people get skeptical and cynical. So even though I'm the best in the world, the media calls me the king of Vegas sports gambling, even though I've assembled the best team ever, 21 great sports handicappers at VegasWinners.com. And you have 21 heroes to choose from who all are very good at what they do. I still wanted to give away $1,000 in free winners at VegasWinners.com to make everybody come register and, and do their thing. Yeah, it seems like you've got it all over at VegasWinners.com. You've got free picks. You've got the best bets. And you're doing it every single day, not just yourself, but 21 champion sports betting experts. Dude, this feels like a, a deal that's too good to be true. It's fully automated. It's completely private. Uh, you'll never even speak to anyone. So go check it out. Get a thousand bucks. Are you listening to that? It's vegaswinners.com. Just log on to vegaswinners.com. That's vegaswinners.com. And you don't get all of our shows here on my world. You get all of our shows on all of the shows here on our network. So Bruce Pritchard show and Eric Bischoff show and Tony Schiavone show and Jim Ross's show and Kurt Angle show and Arn Anderson show. You get them early, you get them ad free, a piece of bonus content from everybody each month, interactive stuff, special guests, adfreeshows.com is the place to be, but let's talk about why we're really here. All right. Oh, stop. Okay. Trains cake. No. Hey, you said that I didn't reference at the very top. I said, I want to thank you. Who's the leader of the ad free family. Okay. So I did get, so don't, don't, don't. Don't get froggy already. It's just not worth it. You you're such a grump today. Oh, because, oh. <laughs> okay. I see how it is. Let me get my mouthpiece in. Oh, uh, get this out. Ad free shows in this month, Conrad. Uh, if you are a my world lister, I'm gonna be. Uh, I'm gonna be on. I, I think I've got a Q and A coming up. I think uh, me and uh, EB, Mr. Bischoff, have a watch along. Uh, we got some pretty cool stuff. So um, yeah, dive in. Adfreeshows.com. It is without a doubt. I like to call it. If you want to go back to old school, you call it a fan club, but it's so much more than that, but the value and what you get with our good old buddy zoom, it's, it's quite remarkable. Uh, I just did some signings and you know, that's an up close and personal experience, but you don't only have, you know, and, and Mick Foley was sitting right beside me for a while with signing autographs and Mick, uh, and myself, we, we chatted offline and said, you know, you got to sign autographs. You just can't, we call it the shuffle sign, sign, move, sign, move, sign, move. I, that ain't, that just, that don't cut it for, for either one of us. So sign, hello, have a little quick conversation, but at ad free on our zoom, we get to, uh, get chastised. We get to get granular and we get to have uh, one on one conversations, uh, with the top guys. And, you know, even old pond water can come up to me and say, you got blown up Jeff, didn't you? <laughs> Shout out to Pondwater. Uh, this time next month, he'll be in the uh, Texas Wrestling Hall of Fame. Who would have thought, man? They must have really lowered the bar to let Pondwater in, huh? Hey, 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 hey! Your your impersonation of that story is the best, <laughs> buddy. It gets on me every time. Uh 
Hey, hey, it's Conrad Thompson. Thanks for checking out the podcast here on YouTube. Be sure to hit the subscribe button and the notifications bell so you can notice any time we upload some new content. And go save yourself some money right now. If you're in a 30-year loan or you have credit card debt, it's not a matter of if I can save you money. It's a matter of how much. Find out right now for free at SaveWithConrad.com.